Hi everybody, it's Honest John again, and welcome to another Sunday Sermon for Atheists. Pride is listed by Christians as one of the seven deadly sins. Now as atheists, we may not believe in sin, at least in the same sense that religious people do. We don't believe in the soul, which oddly enough seems to kind of be a scorecard that their God can look at it and see the record of our trans transgressions. We don't believe that we will be sent to hell for all eternity, but we do believe in right and wrong, good and evil. And the majority of us seek to lead moral lives. Now, some religious people believe that we are doomed and damned, and that without God, we can't possibly have any sense of what constitutes morality. And yet, the jails are not filled with atheists, and the most heinous crimes against humanity appear to be the province of the most fanatically religious. But if there is one fault, one sin, that atheists are most prone to, it is the sin of pride. We can be so smug, so superior, so sanctimonious, so convinced that the wrongness and stupidity of those who believe that reason debate becomes impossible. Even when arguing among ourselves, the stridency and disrespect with which we treat each other is stunning. We must remember that we have a common cause, and we must know what that common cause is. Some of us seem to think it is the end of religion. It's not. It doesn't matter to me that people believe or disbelieve. The arguments between atheists and theists about the existence of God are fun and amusing, but they are pastimes. They are not part of the real battle. There are those who would try to impose their beliefs on everybody else, to make us do as they do to even make us pray as they pray. This is the battleground. This is the real battleground. And in this battle, it will be vital to ally ourselves with people of faith who recognize that threat for what it is. And we can't bridge the space between us with sneers and contempt. Only humility and respect can accomplish that. Thanks for listening.